Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the Elder Scrolls 4 Oblivion where we drink, we <laughs> drink our way around Skingrad. So we finished another cave of confusion uh, in the last episode and now we are moving on to the best part of Oblivion. It's a shopping spree. Right. We were going to go in here, weren't we? The hammer and tongs. Wait, I've leveled up again. Oh, damn it. Hello. Not so loud, please. What a headache I've got. I'm Agnet the Smith. The pickled, they call me. Sure wish I was pickled right now. My kind of a woman. Uh, rumors. That Elsie Godhater sure has a chip on her shoulder. Great with a blade, but she really holds a grudge against the church. Can you blame her? What about skin grab? Well, the local wine is great. It isn't cheap. But I don't bother with beer or ale anymore. And for a Nord, that's saying something. I think I found my true love. Right, do you like me? This no, better be no, good. No, you really, really don't. Uh, you don't like boasting. You like jokes and coercion. Not bad. Whatever you want. I doubt it. Don't talk such rot. No more. You're fright. Good one. I doubt Don't waste your flattery on me. Not now. I doubt it. Not bad. Don't. Please. Don't waste your flattery on me. I ex sure. I doubt it. I doubt it. Not now. I accept. That's pretty good. Um. Yeah. Whatever you want. Not. I doubt it. Don't waste your flattery on me. Sure. That's cute. I doubt. Yes. Yes! I doubt it. Don't talk no more. Not bad. Perfect. All right, I get it. So. May I interest you in some of my fine wares? Ooh, you've got a fine iron, so iron short sword and a fine iron long sword. Actually, the fine iron long sword. Oh, helm of ferocity. That's not great, but you know. Interesting. You don't have any better armor for me, unfortunately, because everything you have seems to be heavy. But I will take a fine iron... Well, in fact, no, I'm going to haggle with you first. Um, so, 60. And let's try and buy this. No deal. No deal. Um, 57. You've got to be... Or 55. That's just not re... Oh. Uh, 52? You've got to be... Seriously? What about 50? You need to make a better offer. 45? <laughs> that's a good deal. Okay, I'm glad that's a good deal for you. I'm glad. Oh, bugger! I bought the wrong bloody one. I wanted the long sword. Right. Uh, sell you back the fine iron short sword. F sell you the steel short sword. You drive a hard bargain. Sell you the boots. Sell you the fur. A good price. That seems a fair. Sell you the fur. I'm gonna keep the greaves. Uh, ooh. No, I'm gonna save these. For a vendor who's a little more friendly, shall we say? I'm gonna come back and see me again. Keep the bow as backup. Bye. Oh, don't you start. Right. That's it's not nicer, but it's it's longer and it does more damage, so I'm happier with it. Right. Let's try out this shop here. I'm only asking for a single coin. I've already given you a single coin. Ingredients taken from plants will grow back later in the month. Hello. Hello. Yes? Rumors? 
I've heard some strange stories about Count Isildur. I'm sure they couldn't be true, though. You're just not going to tell me anything about it? Take care. You don't even own this shop. You. Welcome to Kolovian Traders, Skingrad's finest selection of general merchandise. I'm Gunder. Just let me know what you want. I want rumors. I've had about enough of Sir Lazar. He thinks he's so much better than everyone else. And what about Skingrad? I like Skingrad just fine. Folks are a little quiet by Skyrim standards, but they're friendly and loyal when they get to know you. Uh, yes? Let's chat you up. So let's see. Not coercion. You like a go joke. You don't like being admired. But you don't mind a boast. Oh, please. Oh, weird. Don't. Really? Interesting. Um, what a great story. Try that. Oh, where'd you... What not? That's just talk. Um... That's... I wish I could say that. You're wasting your br... Oh, I... What nonsense. What no... Really? <laughs> you... Say, <laughs> that's really funny. Rem... That... Say... <laughs> I don't talk such rot. What not? Really? You're... W <laughs> Say, that's really funny. Oh, I like what? N I wish I could. Is that so? Excellent. May well, I interest you? Me. Excellent. You're an apprentice, so I'm gonna go for like a 65. Oh, you've got. You've got better weapons than the weaponsmith. Oh, you've got light, better light armor. Well, I don't have a helmet at the moment, do I? Best of the Bard. I kind of should take that, shouldn't I? Um, sell me a hammer. I want two. You've got to be kidding. Really? What if I take it down to 62? Give me, give me one hammer. An excellent deal. Sixty-four. Excellent. Okay, sixty-four works. Um, right, what do I want to sell you? I want to sell you the mage's robes? An excellent bargain. Uh, I'm definitely selling you uh, this. That's more than I'd usually pay. Definitely selling you that. Um, That's a fair. And let's just sell all of this. Sh That's more than I all of the potions you I've made that aren't healing. That's a fair. You drop. You. Dr I know. I you drive. drive. Bargain, right? That seems a fair. You've that's a fair deal. A fine. Um, that's a fair. Take all of these. That's more than I'd usually pay. I'm gonna keep the water breathing potion because you never know when that might come up. So uh, that seems. So, uh, that's a fair deal. Sell so, that. Uh, sell all the weak potions of sorcery. You drive a hard bargain. Um. Let's see. Can I get a 17? That's just not reasonable. I know it's not reasonable. What about a 68? You're trying to drive me. What about a 66? I can't afford to do it. What about a 65? That's a fair deal. Okay. So you have two wolf pelts, a pearl. Flawless pearls. You got a great. You're only giving me seven for? That seems a bit underwhelming. Um. Yeah, no, I think I'm good now. Nearly at 3,000. Um, oh, I can sell Burning Touch. Open very easy locks. 
I mean, I'm going to keep the assassination newspaper just to keep in my house when I get a house. Um, but everything else seems good. Do I want to sell the quilted shoes? Do I prefer the green shoes to the quilted? No, I prefer the quilted shoes. I'm lying Tell to your friends that about I me. like the green shoes. I don't like the green shoes as much as I like the quilted shoes. Farewell. It just... It's just not the same. Yeah, I prefer the quilted shoes. They look... What a worth... What a worth more. You're worth four. You're, okay, nope. Made nope. You're right, you're right. They are the more expensive The wind shoe. be on your back. That Elsie god hate. Welcome to Colo... What can I interest you in? Right. Oh yeah, I didn't actually look at what I wanted to buy off of you before I sold you everything. Um, the haggle price is still the same. Uh, here, have a pair of quilted shoes. And then, um... You're a fine negotiator. I will take that and it's only one armor for thirty-eight gold. I get the same out of a fur helmet. I didn't sell you all my armor, did I? No, I didn't. Um... I think I might go with... I'm gonna buy these. A pleasure to... Thank you. Farewell! How do these look on me? Oh, that is so much better. 100% better. Good day! I'll, Have a look around. I will sell you my. You won't find better prices in all towns. And I think I'm happy with my outfit now. I. Thank you for your patronage. And it matches my shoes. Farewell. Oh. Definitely very happy. Right. Oh, I was going to sell the. Uh, Oh, that's much nicer. That's a much nicer sword. Um, I was gonna sell you. Hello. I hope I can. I was gonna have sell a look you around. Iron. You won't find an iron sword. Um, come back and. S no worries. Be seeing you. Where do we go from here? Well, to be honest, I need another sleep, but I think that can wait till I get to Kavach, or where, wherever it is. Um, I'm going to go check out the other tavern and see if they sell any boots. Oh, actually, loaf of bread. I can make a... Have pity on an old war veteran. I've definitely paid you money. Who are you? Good morning. Morning. We children are starving. Please help. No. Right, where's this other inn? I want some booze. Some tum to take with me, and some for now. Oh, who are you? Dion. We're here to help. Um, rumors. I believe the rugged climate of Bruma suits Narina Carvain. She's tough and cold, but you always know what to expect from her. What about skin grad? Try our wines and cheeses and Salmo's sweet rolls. See the castle, but don't expect to see the Count. He doesn't mix with strangers. Glarthir? <laughs> Total nutcase if you ask me, but he's never done anything yet that we could arrest him for and directions what are you looking for 
Uh, where can I sleep? The West Wheeled Inn is across from the guilds inside the North Walls. Two Sisters Lodge is inside the South Walls, in the West, near the gate. Thank you. On your way, sir. Take care. How do you How do? do? You do? Come on, join the Fighters Guild, see the world, and get paid for it. Tempting, but um, good day. I have a mission, a mission from the Emperor. Ooh, a bakehouse. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Didn't want to break in. I thought it was a shop. What's up here then? Interesting. Hello. Do you sell booze? I'm Ma Gramogak, proprietor of Two Sisters Lodge. My sister and I own the place. Two sisters, see? Need a bed? Good food? Ugak Gramogak. My sister, Ugak Gramogak, runs the Grateful Pass stables. She's the quiet one. I'm the talker. Right. Skingrad, what can you tell me? Don't count on seeing the Count at the castle. He's a great sorcerer, but he doesn't like visitors. I can imagine. Especially with a face like yours. I think Adriana Berena is the ranking mage at the Mages Guild in town. Typical snooty mage. Oh dear. Well. Say what oh you're going God, to say. You don't like me. You do like being admired. You don't like jokes. You don't like boasting, but you do like coercion. So, if I do, your ri goodness, I doubt it. I can't argue with that. I doubt you. Oh no. You do me too much on. I doubt I w You should. Please. I'm embarrassed. I doubt you. You should be ashamed. I doubt. That's not. I am ashamed. Please. I'm a. I doubt. That's. Your. No. You do me too much honor. Goodness. I doubt. That's enough. Get away from me. Really. I doubt. I won't. Not funny. That works for me. Need a bite to eat? Maybe something to wash it down. Um, I'm gonna try you at 70 and buy a sweet roll. You've got to be... What about 65 and buy a sweet roll? Okay, you'll let me buy at 65. What about 67? And I'm gonna buy some Tamika Vintage 415. You don't expect me to make that deal, do you? What about 66? You need to make a better... What about 65? Okay, and then I'll buy a Sorelli Brothers, and then uh, I tell you what, I will buy all your cheap wine. Excellent That'll deal. keep me going on the road. A pleasure to serve you. Thank you. Be seeing you. I want to bed. Mm. I think I can wait. Right, so... Sweet roll. I'm just gonna eat the sweet roll now. With a nice bottle. And then... I also wanted to... Bread loaf and rat meat. I'm sure you can buy that, right? A pleasure to... I offer the finest goods and the lowest prices in all Cyrodiil. Buy the Detect Life. You drive a hard bargain. You know Come it. back and see me again. Uh, I probably will. You, you too. You seem a lot friendlier than the other inn that I went to. Um, where's this go? Oh, nice. I can break into the Sorelli brothers' house from here. Uh, right. I need to head off, I believe. Um, I left my horse the other side, didn't I? Um, I'm gonna check if he's magically teleported to this side, but if not, I'm going to have to go and ride all the way round. Uh, 
Uh, you don't look like my horse. You are not my horse. You are a horse that's clearly escaped that no one seems to care about. Um, right. I will grab my horse and ride around outside of Skingrad if they won't let me bring my horse into Skingrad. Bit disappointed I didn't manage to upgrade my armor. But I did upgrade my sword. I'm quite happy about that. It's a bit longer, does a bit more damage, hits a bit slower, but I'll live. Oh, I can hit you from further away, that's the more important thing. Come on, buddy. Let's go for the slowest ride around the outside, shall we? I'm sure this one will be we'll bring us to the right place. That looks like a tomato farm. And if we ride up this side. Alright. Come on. Oh, there's a rat. Sword just kill him in one hit. Fantastic. I should probably, whilst I'm at this, suit up. I think I'm ready for the road. Ooh, what are they? I have to say, I think alchemy is single-handedly single-handedly bankrolling us at the moment as a skill. But it's also probably why I'm leveling up so quickly. In fact, what level is my alchemy now? 45. I'm nearly at a journeyman level. And I'm pretty sure that a journeyman level, they allow us to make... Uh, they allow us to see the third thing that a, uh, a thing can be. Sneak's almost at 25, so I'm nearly an apprentice in Sneak. Yeah, I think I might need to chill out with Alchemy for a bit, just because I think I might be doing damage to my health. This is lovely. This is absolutely gorgeous. And they're making our lady's favorite product. Wine. Oh, speaking of which... That's Sorelli's Sorelli brother's bottle. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Can I? Coming. Not even gonna try stealing my money. You're just gonna go for me. Shield doesn't really do much for me. Iron Mace doesn't really do much for me. Let's check out this camps. Oh, hey there, Wolfie. Ow! Oh no, it's not a wolf. It's a dog. So we can't get dog pelt. Is 
there is a campsite here. I'm going to take this bowl meat. Hmm. Oh, and one of those alien wells. But I'm assuming this is that bandit's camp. I would be surprised if they've got another one at the other side ready to jump us or something. Oh ah, well. How far are we from Kavach? Uh, not that far. Probably. Oh, in fact, that, that's probably it there. If we just keep riding, we'll probably make it. Try my let's try my new sword against these imps. Not great. Can't complain. But probably will. Uh, I don't think... I don't think I'm up for fighting this cave right now. I think for now, we are so close that I'm gonna... By the end of this episode, I will be in Kavach. Ooh, Nightshade. They make some good poisons, don't they? and upwards, I guess. Hmm. What a lovely day. I wonder what we will come across next. What's that thingy over there? Getting distracted. As long as it's not like a... Oh. That's an alien ruin. But what's this? Let's just have a little bit of an explore, shall we? What are you? We shrine to Tiber Septim. Be strong for war and fight evil. Pray at my chapel altars and receive my blessing. Oh, this is... The, so what's his blessing? Um, fortify strength. Fist of Talos. Definitely most badass blessing. Let's see if we can swing by this alien ruin and just, like, get it on our maps, shall we? Oh, there's a camp as well. Swinging by alien ruins. Oh, there's goblins. Now, from what I remember fighting goblins in the sewers, they are not that difficult. and a lot They don't give great loot, but they aren't that difficult. Round Miss Carcand. Hmm. 
Somebody's found me. You, you found me. I think you're meant to have a bow, aren't you? Oop. Not that I wanted it. Um. Nah. Weighs eight. It's a heavy bow. They got a lot of scales for some some guys that some goblins that aren't near any water. They got a lot of scales. Oh, there's a slaughterfish here, which also has scales. Oh, and one here. Intriguing. Oh, have I just killed some fishing goblins? What is this? Who are you, fella? Are you fighting this eagle, or are you... Is this eagle, like, on your shoulders? Like, what, what's the deal here? Kind of feels a bit elven in design. Hmm. Do we go explore? Do we, do we, do we? Yes. Yes, we do. Let's go for a bit of an adventure, shall we? Search that, search these. I'm sorry, Kavach. Wherever you were, your time will come. But it is not today. Deep into the mines, into the... Into Miss Carcand we go. Right. Well, there's blood and a rusty mace. More blood. And a goblin. Something's going on here. Oh. Fish goblin. It's a bitter fish goblin. They've got big like, scales. Intriguing. There's some zombies down here as well. Now, if I remember, the zombie in the tutorial dungeon was not that difficult to kill, but. That was also the tutorial dungeon, so let's not go getting ahead of ourselves, shall we? Come here, zombie, zombie, zombie. Take some of that mort flesh. Does this go anywhere? I can't open this. This is open remotely. I can hear a skeleton somewhere. Let's just continue down. See what's down here, shall we? Oh, goblin getting killed by some skellies. Multiple goblins getting killed by some skellies. Oh, I've been spotted. But I don't know by what. Oh, this goblin here. Skeletons aren't that difficult. 
the zombies definitely seem a bit tougher than skeletons, but overall not too bad. Continue. Is there a, is there a way of opening this door around here? Is there a way of getting up if I get down? I think I better just explore somewhere else. Oh, hey, buddy. You definitely seem a bit tougher than your compatriots, but that's not too bad. You seem to be seem to be dealing with them like it's not been too much of an issue stepping softly hiding in the shadows you do everything in your power to remain undetected you have become an apprentice of sneaking when you are sneaking you now do extra damage whilst attacking a character that does not detect you well is this not the perfect time? Because I'm pretty sure zombies are not very good at detecting people. Oh. You're going to just run over there into the light, are you? Let's creep. Oh, nope. You're coming this way. Are you looking at me? You're kind of looking at me. I can't really tell. Because you're kind of dead. Ooh, six times damage. Uh, fire. Okay, I may have overfaced myself with this fight. Oh. Oh no. Ah! Locked me. Oh, you. Oh, shit. Right. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Okay. Go on. Keep the restoration going. Now there's only one of you. That was a tough fight. Right, I think I'm going to need a bit of R&R &R after that. And uh, I believe that brings us to the end of the episode. So, uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed your. I hope you've enjoyed this beginning exploration to what seems like a far more complex dungeon than I was expecting. Once again. <laughs> oh boy. Yep. This is going to be... This is going to be an adventure. Okay, so these were the zombies I could see from up there. I should have just attacked them with a fireball, but ah well. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you next time, and please have a good day. Thank you. Bye.